Hi, boys and girls. I am so excited for the next couple of weeks. I'm sure Mrs. Varsi has told you, but we are going to be looking at a whole bunch of gingerbread boy, girl, man stories. And I can't wait to share them with you. I hope you enjoy it. Our story today is called The Gingerbread Boy by Richard Edgalski. I wonder if you're looking at the cover, where you think this little gingerbread boy lives. There's some clues there. I wonder if you can figure it out. Is he living in the city or in the country? There was a woman and a man who had no children. One day, the woman took flour, eggs, butter, brown sugar, molasses, ginger, cinnamon, salt, and a pinch of black pepper to make some dough. She rolled it flat and cut out the shape of a little boy. Then, with candy, nuts, and icing, she made his face and clothes. There you are, she said, my gingerbread boy, and she put him in the oven to bake. He baked up nice and brown, but so hot that he shot right out of the oven, across the room, and through the window. The woman and the man cried, gingerbread boy, please stop. But the gingerbread boy only laughed and said, Run, 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 as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And he ran off. Oh, my goodness. That would have been quite a surprise. Look at the, look at the lady. She actually fainted. It scared her, I think. Oh, my goodness. Look it. He got out on the street. The lady is trying to get out from her fire escape, and it looks like the guy kind of got trapped in his ladder. Where is that gingerbread boy going? Until he meant a rat. You smell good, said the rat. I'm going to eat you. But the gingerbread boy only laughed and said, Run, 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 as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And he ran off. Oh, my. Not only does he have the man and the woman chasing him, he now has the rat chasing him. Look where he is. He's on a clothesline until he met some construction workers. Hey, you, gingerbread boy, they shouted. You're just the snack for our coffee break. But the gingerbread boy only laughed and said, run, 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 as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And off he ran. So now the construction workers are in on the chase. Oh, I wonder what's going to happen next. Until he meant some musicians. Yummy, 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 they sang. But the gingerbread boy only laughed and said, Run, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And off he ran. Oh my goodness, look at everybody chasing him now. What did he do? He got on a thing called a subway. It's like a bus that's underneath the ground. Look at him waving and being all sneaky. Until he met a policeman on a horse. Stop! Stop in the name of the law! The policeman called. We're hungry! But the gingerbread boy only laughed and said, Run, 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 as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. And off he ran. Look at them go. There is really a lot of people chasing after him. Do you think they're going to get him? Let's find out. Until he meant a fox. 
By now, the gingerbread boy was feeling pretty proud of himself. I've run away from the woman and the man, the rat, the construction workers, the musicians, and the policeman on a horse. And I can run away from you, too, he bragged. Run, run, run. No, 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 the fox interrupted. I don't want to eat you. But there is a big lake up ahead, and that crowd you're running from is catching up. Oh, what should I do? asked the gingerbread boy. Hop on my tail and I'll carry you across, said the fox. So the gingerbread boy hopped onto the fox's tail. Then the fox said, It will be easier to hold on if you climb onto my shoulders. So the gingerbread boy climbed onto the fox's shoulders. This lake is getting deeper than I thought, said the fox. And if you get wet, you'll crumble away to nothing. Why don't you crawl out onto my nose? So the gingerbread boy crawled out onto the fox's nose. Ha ha, laughed the gingerbread boy. They'll never get me now. You're right said the fox as she flipped him in the air and she opened her mouth. I'm wondering if you think that was a good idea. Do you think the gingerbread boy should have jumped on the fox's nose? And the gingerbread boy was all gone. Look at that fox. Now that fox looks pretty. Pretty proud.